First of all, thank you very much indeed for joining us on such a busy day for you. Thank you for having me. It's a pleasure. Isn't it great? The March meeting's finally underway here in Las Vegas. It's wonderful. Here we are back together again. Now, you're chair of the uh, organizing committee. What, what are some of the best bits of being chair of the organizing committee? This. It's, there's something really euphoric. Our team, made of the APS meeting staff and fellow volunteers, has worked all year round and really working the, with them is, has been such a joy. And then at the end of it all, you see it culminating to this event taking place. I can only say that at this moment, I really do feel a deep love for our community and for the people I've worked with. It was really great, wasn't it, the Kavli Symposium yesterday and the physics that you had, the physicists that you had there. Absolutely. And really, the way it all came together, again, one of these special sessions, also was beautiful. For most of us, I think we really cherish physics from the sort of atomic level to the quantum to, you know, all the way from to the Earth and the cosmic. And this was something we really wanted to share and bring out in this special session. And so we really went through these topics, scale by scale, ultra cold atoms, quantum matter, our precious Earth, and then the entire universe. And to bring it all out and to do justice to it, you really need phenomenal, phenomenal scientists and speakers. And we were so lucky to be able to bring them. And they were so enthusiastic, so kind and receptive. And so you see it all come together in this form. And I thought, like you, it really, really was awe-inspiring. Uh, how important do you think it is for physicists to, to sort of engage with the public in, in sort of explaining sort of scientific points of view? And, and uh... I think it's extremely important that we have a good body of people doing it. And the, there are many reasons for that. One, science, what we're made up of, science really explains that everything from the building blocks that make us who we are to the gadgets that we have. I do also think it's extremely important for the public to be informed. And I feel like it needs to be done in a way where it's not this, oh, science is a scary thing. I want to run away from it. it it's really not true. You know, there's this reputation that they run away from us. It's not. I've sat next to people in the airplane, and when I say quantum, they don't look the other way. They say, what? Tell me more, you know? And there's popular culture that has drawn, uh, drawn them in more. And I think we have an opportunity now as scientists. And the last thing is that I feel why the importance of science. Just like music, I really do think the universe is so fundamental to our soul and there's a way of being human that you can really embrace when you know about this cosmos around you. Cast your mind back a little bit. What advice, what thoughts would you give to young people in that same position as you were? So I would say again, be yourself. Right. And I think there's a lot of pressure to be in a certain way and standards, be it in the scientific community or society all around, there's some standards that tell you, oh, this is what makes something good or not. And it takes strength sometimes to dispel that notion. And I think that's really important to set, us, set, it, set it aside and look within yourself as to who you are and just let that grow. And I would also say, you know, it's no matter what you do in life, physics or whatever it is, of course it will be a hard journey and you will fall, but that's okay. You just pick yourself up, find that space that is true to you and, the, and wings will slowly grow. And this is what I think. Now my final question is, as, you, as we've said, lots of people here uh, really engaging. But what would you say for those people who, who want to be part of this, but who can't for one reason or another be here in Las Vegas? For them, I really want to say that there are so many ways and the meetings team has really made an effort to be welcoming, 
uh, and share the news. And so I really do want to welcome them here too. Uh, some of these sessions are live streamed and we have this whole other virtual component that will be taking place. And I feel like it's up to us as a community to engage and feel out what works best and take it forward for the future. Well, thank you so much for taking the time to talk to us today. It was absolutely fascinating. And uh, I hope, the, I'm sure the meeting will continue to go well. So thank you. Well, thank you so much for doing all this.